I guess my life motto has always been um, give everything a go once and give it your best. I don't really like to say no to new things. I like to try everything and um, you never know how you're going to go. 25-year-old Penrith model and makeup artist Nicole Rossetto already holds one Beauty Quest title. She was Miss Indy 2010. Now she has Miss Universe Australia set in her sights. Being a freelance model um, and being a little bit older, I think that benefits me as I've, I have done a little bit of work in the past. Of course, the qualities required of a Miss Indy are somewhat different to that of Miss Universe Australia. What do you think the judges are looking for? Natural beauty or the more glamorous looking girl? Uh, my opinion, I think for Miss Universe, it should be somebody with, um, you know, natural glamour, maybe Obviously, they're, they're going to have to present themselves well. Um, but yeah, somebody with a bit of a natural look, um, not necessarily the white bleach blonde hair. I know I've got blonde, but... <laughs> you know, I, I think, yeah, natural beauty is, is definitely a key to um, success. Nicole's role model is one of Australia's most iconic fashion models. I've always looked up to models such as Elle McPherson, and I know she didn't win Miss Universe or anything like that, but just being who she is and being such a strong-minded woman and going out into the fashion industry and making a change, I think that really changed my mind and, and kind of made me think about what career path I wanted to choose when I was younger. There are many beautiful, strong-minded women amongst this year's New South Wales finalists. The Telegraph can't help noticing several are from the western suburbs. Could the region be on the rise? Saying I'm from Penrith is not uh, the, not the classiest area, <laughs> um, but yeah, I don't think it's an advantage to be from any particular area. As you've seen from the past, we've had girls winning from um, Melbourne. We've had girls from uh, last year, Shirley really Biggs from Western Australia. <laughs> um, so I don't really think an area gives you any sort of um, uh, what's the word I'm thinking uh, advantage. Yeah, I don't think being from a particular area is an advantage. I think it's just you're from. <laughs> Do you think you could win this? I'd like to. <laughs> I'd like to think I could win. Um, you know, I'm going to say yes because I like positive thinking. Um, so yeah, I think I, I could win, but if I will win or not, we'll have to wait and see. Nicole won't have long to wait. The Miss Universe Australia finals will be held at the Sofitel Friday night in Melbourne. Best of luck, Nicole. This is Sarai Feuder for The Telegraph.